Here we continue our discussion about the delays and timers in uh, free autos in uh, ESP IDF. In previous videos we we examined the VTAS delay command which is measured in ticks but the actual use is in millisecond. In order to, to, to have a delay in milliseconds we will write here the number of milliseconds that we, we wish to delay and divide it by the time between ticks. We will see how it, wor we, we, it will, will, will work out because here we are asking for one millisecond delay. Remember that uh, in previous video port tick rate uh, constant was 10 milliseconds. So actually we are asking for 1.0.1 tick delay which is a little bit problematic but still uh, the compiler won't throw an error and will try to perform this task just see how accurate it is fast forward this is not so accurate for the small measurements let's see uh, which delay we actually received and it's 2300 uh, microseconds which is um, 2 milliseconds when we expected to have 1 millisecond we can see here that for small delays like 1, 2, 3 milliseconds the division and uh, some portion of ticks like in here 0 0.1 ticks is quite a problematic delay and we have a big errors in this case fast forward for the longer delays like uh, one second half a second it's pretty good and pretty accurate 